peekaboo wig this hair is brought to you by IC hair company so of course I'm gonna show you what's inside the box a new method on bleaching this unit and also a full customization tutorial and an install tutorial so if that's something you guys are interested in then keep on watching bye Lacey do you think you overdid it with our hair uh -uh. nope I sure don't, because we're going to Beverly Hills. Now, if I'm going to do good at that audition, we got to look like stars. So, in this gorgeous box, it's very high quality. It was packaged just like a present. I just love it, especially for the Christmas season. So, in this box, I received a double-sided bonnet. It has some goodies inside, so I'm going to draw this drawstring and I received a necklace, an edge control brush, a wig cap, a sticker to make your parts natural, an elastic band, a thank you card, a pack of eyelashes, mink, and of course that double-sided bonnet. It was a lot of goodies. I was really excited. <laughs> So in this box, I received a peekaboo wig. So it had 613 hair on the bottom of this unit and a natural 1B on top. This unit is 14 inches at 180% density. This hairline was very, very thick. So we will have to pluck a lot in this unit. This unit is also Brazilian at a 13 by four lace unit with adjustable straps and combs. So you guys, we're gonna spray our hairline with Got To Be Glue spray and comb that back. So I am trying this new bleach out and a new method on bleaching this unit. I seen this on TikTok. I'll have the app on the screen for you guys to follow. I just learned so much on TikTok. So here I'm taking my 30 volume developer and just combing or applying that onto the lace unit first. I believe this softens the lace first and then I put a towel and let that wait for about eight minutes. While that is cooking, I get my DW2 powder and my 20 volume developer. I mix that up and create a thick consistency. After that eight minutes is up, I wash it out. Um, I don't use any shampoo, I just wash it out with water. I apply the Got To Be Glue by Free Spray and comb that back again. Um, in my opinion, doing this I didn't really see a big difference. I just feel like this is more time consuming. The only thing I like about doing this specific method was when I applied this bleach, look at how clean the application is. Like there's no like bleach on the hair um, to avoid like, you know, over bleaching. And then what she did was put foil in a towel and let that sit for about 30 minutes. So after the 30 minutes was up, I did rinse this out with water and um just regular conditioning shampoo you can use any shampoo you guys i think it doesn't really matter i think the only thing that matters is having a purple conditioner or shampoo this one is a conditioner and i let this conditioner sit on the lace and the blonde 613 part for over an hour do it as long as you can you guys and then i finished it off with some silicone mix on the black part and it turned that hair gray look at that it turned the hair gray i didn't have to tone it i was thinking about toning it but i want to you know show you guys an easier method to turning 613 hair gray here i'm taking my um shine mist this stuff is so bomb especially if you're pressing out your hair or your wigs as you can see there's a little bit of purple conditioner it was kind of hard to wash it off especially if you let it sit for a while but it like fades over time i just love how gray looks on my skin and then like just the hair makes it pop when it's a different color so yeah here i'm just pressing it out track by track super easy doing the chase method i have all the um you know not ingredients but the styling tools down in the description so here i'm going to pluck this unit i'm gonna tell you this now even though you know up close it looks really good this hairline was very very thick so i did have to put some elbow grease into this unit 
So get your hot comb and just press out the ends and just pluck away. Make sure you don't pluck in the same spot. Um, take your time. It took me 30 minutes to pluck this unit, you guys. And to be honest, it doesn't, you really don't see a difference, but you do see a difference, you know? I pluck so, so much hair off of this wig. So just have patience. Maybe put on like, you know, a movie or some music while you're plucking this unit. So you guys, is it me or is my skin just skinning? Oh my gosh, I just got out the shower, washed my hair and put my hair in some twists and just prepared to put my hair or my wig on. So I'm doing the double cap. The reason why I do this double cap, you guys, is to hold my hair um, with the first cap. It's nothing like super different and new. It just holds my hair. It's not like a big deal. A lot of people ask like, why do you do two caps? It's just to hold my natural hair and not like the hair poking out from the wig when you like apply your wigs. But I'm gonna stop talking because I'm talking a lot. I'm gonna play, you know, some music. If you're new to my channel, I like to play some vibey music while you watch me install this unit. If you do want to know, like, you know, a specific detailed version on how I apply my units, definitely check out my 2021 lace wig installed. But we're gonna get this started, okay? <laughs> down a snowflake if you made it to the end and was vibing with me that song was just lit you know i love 
adding some vibey music as you can see i am working on my baby hairs i did some simple baby hairs because you know i wanted the peekaboo color to just be the star of the show not the baby hairs you know but yeah this is basically it it was super easy to style very good quality hair this is by far my favorite unit thank you so much ic hair company for letting me chop this gorgeous gorgeous unit don't forget you guys to like comment subscribe and share down below and i'll see you in my next video bye been trying to get my weight up, staying prayed up, meditating and taking time away.